Hello Sagittarius, this is Renee and welcome back. Hey there Sag, this is going to be your next 48 hours. What's going on? What to expect? What's coming in the next 48 hours? This reading is timeless, so when you see this video is when you're meant to receive it. And actually when I was meditating on your energy... Sagittarius, I was really seeing that someone very close to you, this may be your energy, maybe not, but I feel like someone very close to you is being stubborn. Um, someone is really putting their pride before anything else. And I also feel a lot of regret. So... Um, I really want to tap into the energy. Let's see what's going on for Sagittarius. Let's get into this. Let's find out more information. Okay. So, so what's going on with Sag in the next 48 hours? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What's going on with Sag in the next 48 hours? Okay. We have the Five of Pentacles. The Page of Wands, the Seven of Pentacles, and the Chariot. Okay. We also have the Ace of Wands energy. So I feel like, you know, you may be going through a little bit at the moment, Sagittarius, but I feel like there's a spark at the end of the tunnel. Okay, there's this dim light that you can see that you know, whatever this is that you're going through, I feel like that light is leading you out of the situation. Okay, this is a new perspective on what you may be dealing with at the moment. Um, but I feel like this is an, a chance for a new beginning in whatever the situation is. Okay, um... We also have the Three of Pentacles, so I feel like you do have help. Things are going to go okay. You are going to be okay in the situation. There's definitely people around you who care and love you very much. And you have support. You have full recovery. Um, you're going to get some kind of communication. Some kind of love is coming in for you. Okay. Um, <clears throat> So let's tap into this. Let's see what's going on for Sagittarius. Okay, Sagittarius, I'm feeling like you're feeling very unappreciated. Like things just aren't going the way that you want them to go. Like I said, I feel like there's someone who's being very stubborn. Um, someone who's being very prideful. In the situation, they... But I feel like they're coming through. I feel like they they just needed some time away. They needed some time, some space to think. But I feel like whatever the situation is, this person wants to communicate. They may send you a message. Um, but I feel like this person just wants you to hear them out. I feel like you may not totally understand everything this person is saying to you or understand their feelings. But I feel like they have a lot that they need to get out right now. And they just want you to listen, to to hear them, to see them, you know. Um, I feel like, you know, if you're able to listen, I feel like this person really wants to work things out. They really want to work things out and move forward because um, I feel like there's a lot of tension at the moment with you and this person um, this may be a love this may be uh, some sort of friend family member but I feel like you know they they feel like it's worth the effort to try and work things out because they they want to move on with the situation Okay, they wanted to, you know, move to the next level, become stronger. Okay, that's what I'm getting. 
Okay, more messages for Sagittarius. What do we have for Sagittarius? Okay, we have the Justice. So I definitely feel like things are working out for the better. We have the Three of Pentacles. Like I said, I feel like there's support. Um, you may have children that you're supporting that you have to focus on. Um, but I feel like there's someone that you're able to talk to about the situation. There's someone that's actually being very supportive. Um, and the Four of Cups. Okay, so I feel like this person is doing a lot of thinking about you. I feel like this person is very passionate. They definitely want some kind of new beginning with you. They want this to be renewed. Um, they want a fresh start. They want some kind of decision to be made. You to understand their point of view. I, I do feel like this person has a lot of desire. Um, maybe some things that they're focused on that maybe they put above you. Um, but I feel like this person finds a lot of value in the relationship that you have and and they feel like it's worth every minute that you spend together that is what I'm getting every minute that you spend together is valuable to this person hmm I do feel like you and this person are caught up in feelings of maybe regrets feeling unsatisfied, feeling um, unfulfilled at times, but I feel like there's a lot of passion. There's a lot of drive to keep moving. Um, I feel like with this person, you feel like the chemistry is just there. The, the chemistry between you and this person is like, it's like sparks. It's like lightning. Okay, um, I feel like you kind of feel it when you're in the room with this person because I feel I'm, I'm really sensing that you and this person spend a lot of time thinking about each other. So it may be that you've been away from each other for a while. Uh, maybe you haven't had any contact because of some kind of breakup, some kind of situation that has taken you away from them. Um, but I feel like you and this person think about each other and about this chemistry that you have with each other all the time. Okay? This person is really, really thinking about you. They're thinking about how to work things out, how to make things work, how to move forward in the situation. Let's get some clarity with the after tarot. We're going to tap into the after tarot to get some clarity. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we have the King of Cups energy. This person has a lot of love for you. They have a lot of love for you. They want to support you. They want to nurture you. I also feel like this person can control their feelings. As to where <coughs> you might not notice how much pain this person is really in because I feel like they cover it very well okay um, but I feel like there is some kind of decision that needs to be made in the situation there is some kind of final decision that um, will bring some kind of renewal some kind of new beginning some kind of better situation I feel like it may be leaving one place for another is what I'm getting. It's very really interesting, but that's what I'm getting. Okay, we have the Four of Cups on the Four of Cups. So I feel like maybe one of you is saying, you know, out of sight, out of mind. You know, I'm not going to, I'm going to let this go. I have to let this go because it's hurting too much to keep it. But I feel like 
you know, you and this person can't get each other off of your mind, even though you're trying very hard. And I feel like this person is trying very hard not to think about what you have or what you had in the past. Because they're, they're like dumping out their emotions. They're trying to find things to keep them busy, things to keep them occupied. Okay. We have the two of swords. I feel like there's a decision that needs to be made, but I feel like either you or this person are hesitating. You you're like expecting someone else to make the decision. Although you know the decision lies within yourself. There's some kind of choice that needs to be made that you're not making. Okay? And we have the hangman energy. And I'm really sensing this hangman energy is needing to look at the situation from the other person's point of view. I feel like that's where you get your enlightenment. That's where it becomes more clear. When you really... And seriously, look at the situation from your person's point of view. Okay? What else does Sagittarius need to know? <clears throat> Seven of Cups. Okay, all opportunities are not gold. There are some things that may be seen as opportunities or options, but I feel like they're illusions. Too many illusions can lead to not being able to commit to that one true opportunity. So I feel like that may be an issue to commit to that one true opportunity. That's what I'm getting. So there may be some kind of commitment issue, some kind of issue that's being re unresolved at the moment. Um, hmm. Tell me more, Spirit. The Three of Wands. Okay, you've been waiting. You've been waiting for this new beginning to happen. I feel like you've been patiently waiting. But you feel like you've waited long enough. You feel like it's gone on for too long. And now you or this person are tired of waiting for this new beginning to happen. You know? And, and this new beginning is here. But you just have to be willing to commit to the situation. To stop waiting and just go for it. Because I feel like you and this person have been waiting too long. Um, there may be things that you're protecting. You and this person. But I feel like it's kind of leading you away from your situation. And not bringing you towards your situation. You know what I mean? Um, very interesting. I feel like you just need to follow and trust. Follow and trust where the, where the universe is leading you, Sagittarius. Use your intuition. Use that inner gut feeling to kind of drive you to the path where you're destined to be. Okay? Because I feel like there's a lot of abun abundance, a lot of love, a lot of... A lot of gratitude... Um, on the other side of that curtain, you know, and I feel like, you know, you've been waiting very much too long. Now it's time to just take action and move forward instead of waiting for them ships to come in. It's time to take action and move. Okay. Um, someone needs to make the first move and I feel like that may be you. Sagittarius because there is a new beginning here there is a leap of faith that you must take in order to um, move towards this new beginning hmm let's get some angel cards 
Let's see what the angels have to say for Sagittarius. Message for Sagittarius, please. Spirits. What does Sagittarius need to hear? In the near future. So I feel like if this is a relationship that you're pursuing, I feel like it's destined to happen in the near future. This is something that you're going to get some kind of resolution in the near future. It may not be within the next 48 hours, um, but I feel like it's, it's, it's in the near future, okay? Um, I feel like you and this person have some things that you need to work out. You have some things that you need to communicate with each other. Um, so I believe it's just a beginning. Um, hmm. If you have any questions, if you have any questions that need to be answered, I feel like there will be a peaceful resolution. Um, so I feel like it's all going to work out. Just don't stop. I feel like Spirit is letting you know to make the first move. If you believe, if you believe in the situation, if you believe in this person, I feel like you shouldn't stop. You should keep pursuing what this is, you know, keep moving forward, Sagittarius, because um, I feel like there is a, a, a good resolution to the situation. I feel like you guys have a lot of feelings for each other. Um, if this is love. If this is friendship, you know, I feel I feel the same thing. Um, and it doesn't matter if you're male or female. Okay, we have inner strength. Move back to wholeness. Recognize that you have the power. Okay, Spirit wants to, you to know that you're very powerful at this moment, Sagittarius. Shine your light. Your internal guidance is coming through loud and clear. Using your intuition, you know, don't block your blessings by, you know, not focusing on what that inner voice is telling you. And open communication. Get a weight off your chest. Speak up with love and be heard. Okay? So Spirit is letting you know that this needs some kind of communication. Communication needs to be spoken and received. In the situation so and that goes both ways Sagittarius that goes for yourself and for your person so I feel like yeah this definitely is a love reading but um, I feel like with open communication you and this person will be able to resolve the situation um, because I feel like there's a lot here there's a lot of love there's a lot of longing for this new beginning okay so that is what i have for you sagittarius if this reading resonates please like and subscribe hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads and take a look at your sun moon and rising i have all of the march readings put up in a playlist so take a look at your sun moon and rising in the march playlist and and that may give you more clarity on your situation. If you want to be a cross watcher, um, of course, you can look at your person's sign if you know that. And Sagittarius, until your next reading, many blessings to you. Love and light.